Welcome to the Turkish Republic of North Cyprus. Today I'm riding to an S-tier abandoned city, Varosha. There's the monument to the struggle. Got a big old Ataturk face on top. There's the walls of the old city of Famagusta. And the abandoned city is supposed to be just to the south of that. So we're right on the cusp. All right, starting to see some abandoned buildings here. Apparently there is a way for visitors to get in. It's around here somewhere. Okay, here's the entrance. Because it is forbidden, you cannot enter the Oh, sorry, I thought they entry, said you could sorry. go around on a bicycle. <laughs> huh? You can't... can rent the bike over there. Oh, right. we I have can't, some can't bring my own bike? Okay. <coughs> Fine. Nobody can bring anything with that, okay? You Fair can enough. leave it out if you want to come park there. So I made it to the abandoned city. They don't let you bring your bike in. They make you rent an awkward bike out the front. So here we go. Let's begin the tour. So this is it. It's a full-on abandoned city. It used to be inhabited by the Greek population. It fled after the 1974 invasion the Edelweiss Cafe Incredible I've never seen anything like this This is a post-apocalyptic wasteland. Absolutely insane.
imagine all these seaside resorts thriving tourist industry and now it's nothing all a ghost city See that UN flag up the top? There's a peacekeeping force around here. Turn around. Thank you. Every single one of these buildings all the way down the coast is abandoned.
Phillips. This place just paused in 1974. It's a time capsule of the 70s. Bank of Cyprus. Look at that. Seventies traffic lights. Oh my. It's gotta be the most post apocalyptic thing I've ever seen. How crazy. Toyota. an entire post-apocalyptic main street. This is mind-blowing. It's a little bit disappointing that it's so highly regulated and roped off. If only this could just be all overgrown, all open, all explorable. Like I want nothing more than to just go off the beaten path, head down one of these side streets and just explore to my heart's content. But it's also strict. The army is all so in control of the whole place. It's just, it's a real shame. Would have loved to explore this place a bit more fully. Maybe even stealth camp here. But looks like the only thing I'm gonna be able to see is from these highly regulated streets. That's a shame. Anyway, this has been Varosha, abandoned city. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next one.